we have all seen it happen and questioned why. There isn't a polite way to ask. However, the time has come to address the age-old question of why dogs sniff each other's butts. This issue in particular is as sensitive as a dog's sense of smell. It's critical to comprehend dogs' sense of smell and communication methods in order to answer the question of why they sniff rear ends. Dogs have the same five basic neurologic senses as humans do. Taste, touch, hearing, sight, and smell. In the world of dogs, smell is the most important of these senses. An average dog's nose is anywhere between 10,000 to 100,000 times more sensitive than ours partly because dog noses contain 150 million olfactory receptors, while human noses only have 5 million. And while humans only use 5% of their brains for olfactory functions, dogs devote about 30% of their brain mass to odor detection and identification. Smelling each other's butts is just another example of chemical communication in the animal kingdom. It's like speaking with chemicals, and that's how dogs ask each other about their diet, gender, and emotional state. Furthermore, dogs have an additional olfactory organ in their noses known as the Jacobson's organ. There is zero interference from other odors because this organ is built specifically for chemical communications and has its own set of nerves that connect to the brain. The same organ is used when you see a dog sniffing a fire hydrant or anywhere else there happens to be some dog pee. Researchers who examined the anal secretions of dogs and wild coyotes found that canines have pouches called anal sacs that contain glands that secrete chemicals that canines use to get to know one another. Trimethylamine and a variety of short-chain acids are the main chemical compounds that contribute to a dog's aroma. Because of the acids present, anal sac secretions smell extremely strong and sharp. However, chemical changes in the secretions from a dog's genetics, diet, and current immune status can all affect this aroma. The ideal approach for two dogs to get to know one another is by butt sniffing, which is completely typical dog behavior. If you're worried about how your dog interacts with other dogs, you might train them to sit and remain and ask others to approach to be considerate of your dog's space. Your dog may simply not be in the mood to socialize or may even prefer to socialize with people rather than other dogs. So why do dogs sniff each other's rear ends? It's the same reason why you shake hands with the people you meet, to get to know them a little better. Try not to be embarrassed the next time you witness it. After all, butt sniffing is simply a sign that you've got a budding socialite on your hand. If you enjoyed this video and want to join our journey on learning about the who, what, when, where, why, and how of the human experience, please do not forget to like this video and subscribe to the Reverie Media YouTube channel. You can also connect with us on Twitter at The Reverie Media. We hope to see you there.